The term chip war encapsulates the fierce geopolitical and economic struggle surrounding semiconductors, those tiny yet powerful components at the heart of our modern digital age. This battle began in the mid 20th century with the groundbreaking invention of the transistor in 1947. Its inception marked a seismic shift in electronics, paving the way for the semiconductor industry to flourish. The 1958 introduction of the integrated circuit by pioneers in the field further accelerated this evolution, allowing devices to shrink in size while gaining remarkable processing capabilities. During this time, the United States emerged as the undisputed leader, leveraging its technological prowess and defense investments to dominate the semiconductor landscape. As the decades rolled into the 70s and 80s, Japan rose to prominence in the chip industry. Companies like NEC, Toshiba, and Hitachi capitalized on advancements in memory chip production, notably DRAM, catapulting Japan to a position of global leadership, the U.S. Response to this burgeoning competition was strategic, emphasizing the need for protective measures to preserve its market share. The Semiconductor Trade Agreement of 1986 stands out as an effort to curb Japan's dominance, signifying the intensity of the rivalry even then. However, the competition did not rest. By the 80s and 2000s, Taiwan and South Korea entered the arena with innovative approaches that transformed the industry. The establishment of TSMC in 1987 introduced the foundry model, allowing companies to design sophisticated chips without the burden of manufacturing facilities. South Korea's powerhouses, Samsung and SK Hynix, rose alongside Taiwan, all supported by substantial government investment and commitment to research and development. The rise of these nations showcased a shift in the semiconductor power dynamic as various governments recognized the strategic importance of technological self-sufficiency. Entering the 2000s, the dialogue shifted towards China, which began prioritizing its semiconductor capabilities under the Made in China 2025 initiative. This state-driven investment sought to reduce dependency on foreign technology igniting concerns about the implications of Chinese technological advancements on global markets. The rivalry reached a fever pitch in the 2010s as U.S. China tensions intensified, culminating in a modern chip war where semiconductors represent the front line. The chip industry now stands as a battleground, influenced by national security issues and economic competition. Key events such as the 2019 Huawei restrictions and the Chips Act in 2022 highlight the politicization of semiconductors. Taiwan has emerged as a focal point in this conflict, with its dominance in advanced chip manufacturing raising geopolitical stakes, especially amidst China's assertive claims over the island. The chip war continues to evolve, underscoring the crucial role of semiconductors in shaping the future of global power dynamics.